good. What you say, Michael? My best, or not my best, but uh, my day was good. See what you need to do. What you need to do is have your mama take you to the hospital, and this is what they're gonna do. Cause that time I injured, and it hurts like a bitch. You'll be in there for about like four hours, but when you go in there, they'll give you pain medicine while you're in there. They'll give you like ten. They'll give you pain medicine right when you're in there, cause it will loosen up the pain, and then they'll get an expert done on you and everything. They'll send you. They'll send you home with uh, with thirty. I mean. Oh. Maybe 30 with you, but they'll send 10 to 20 in high school. No. It's right here in the bottom and it hurts like a motherfucker. Well, like I was like her. And I mean, they, like I went too low with my knees hit the uh, as a mouse how can you hear unless you have like ears the unless you're gonna have supersonic hearing or some crap well, i see, mean basically the only thing they're gonna tell you is they're gonna tell you that you need to not do weights for a couple days or a week and then they'll tell you about your backpack they'll say that, that you don't need to carry your backpack because that's how they did with me and then like they'll prescribe you like uh, no, I think she left in Malaysia. Huh? Who? I didn't see her down there. Usually when I come down, she's down, but she went down there. Who? Lee, and I, she was, oh. I was with, it was like Max on a page. Or Chris and White. Did they even swing on each other? She was right there. Was like, Madison Stewart and Paige Richardson. Yeah. No, no, it was uh, Madison uh, Stewart. Oh, Madison Stewart probably got her ass kicked. The only time she's a perfect thing. Paige is in MMA. She can't. Aggressively. Yeah, it's not recommended to. She says it's vulgar. Where were you saying about Paige? Okay, Paige is an MMA. Yeah, I know this. Okay. Paige cannot fight outside of MMA. What you need is my yes, she can. She'll get in trouble. But Only in self defense. But if the only way she can fight is if Madison hits her. And her. Madison won't never. Madison, she won't hit her. Madison because she knows about Paige at an MMA. She wants Paige Yeah, and Paige's all meant to go over her ass. Because I know she goes to Bunny. My mama does too. Yeah, my mom don't do that. My mom works out there. But I see Paige all the time. And she's playing with I people. used to Which see Master Hawker Smith to, to do that for the better part of like a year. Yeah, they have like a defending class. I mean, they have, a, uh, they have martial arts and they have karate. Martial arts, karate. And uh, they have a defending class for like teens and grown-ups. They have jiu-jitsu. I had the uh um, he has so many things. I can get into it as we speak right now. But I don't want to. I had the five to six thirty well, class, I think. Well see it's hard for me to even go there because I'm in school most of the time. And then like my mom goes there faithfully every day. But she goes to school. And then when we get out, either my brothers have that I mean my brother and sisters either have practice or games or my mom goes to work. So it's kinda hard to even go unless I go on the weekends. I can't do it on Sunday because I go to church and they clean the box. So it's kinda hard for me to even do it here yet. Do you go to church on Wednesdays? No, I don't go on Sundays. Oh. Church on Wednesdays and uh and Sundays, the people that go to church on both those days are like are like super duper uh, religious. You know, faith? Yeah. Faith goes Wednesdays and Sundays. I would imagine so. 
I used to go on Wednesdays, but when I was in London here. All we did was start getting hard about letting go back up in the back. Yeah, that's how it was with us, so. Where'd you go? I go to my, right now I go to Mount Sinai in St. Helens. It's over there by, uh, I'll show you, we'll pass it. I use it by your house. You know we're like, uh, um, it's not on the map. I'm trying to think where it's not. I'll show you when we drop the seat now. It's I, almost around with it. Well, you can't really see it too much, but you can. I used to go on Tuesday for the longest time, just because I went to a What's Catholic school. I went to Good Shepherd from Where like the high school. I'm not talking about <laughs> school. church. No church. I don't really go, to, go to church people. anymore. I, I don't really. See, I don't me, I go faithfully every Sunday. I leave at I leave at nine. I can't do that every Sunday. No, I don't do. No, you can. No, 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 no. I don't do that. I go to like because I, I teach my own Sunday class because I'm old enough to do it. So I teach about seven, eight. My sister, my two sisters, my cousin, and then about seven or eight other girls. And I and like the pastor's wife is in there when they do it because I can't explain everything like they can. But most of the time I do that, and it's about because they've been doing it for like. And she's the pastor's wife. She's the only. They've been doing it all their lives. And then you be trying to explain something, they be like, no. And then they, yeah, they explain it. Yeah, okay, so the uh, Catholic school has its own uh, church, and I would go there Sundays. But my grandmother goes to the Spanish mass instead. I'm like, I can't understand that. Spanish? Yeah. yeah she goes to the church. They have Spanish mass at like 1 well, o'clock or so. Uh, so she she I went to church. That's the church I got to. That's the church I got to do it mostly all black. So we got white and stuff here and there, but mostly everybody in the church is black. I went to church last on Christmas, and it was a uh, Spanish mass I got drugged to. You have them people that go crazy. Like they just throw things in and just like down the aisle. There's this one lady. Boy, I tell you, she takes her, she wears heels and everything. She will take her heels off and her little sock and, and her ass will be gone. The Spanish, the Spanish priest. The Spanish priest kind of went fast and... you seen the little one? What? The Spanish priest kind of went fast and then he kind of slowed down and then he went fast and slowed down, fast and slowed down. I'm like, calm down, find a steady speed. Even if I knew Spanish, I couldn't... I couldn't even understand it with your blabbering on about the... <laughs> at the speed you're going. I mean... Whew, he sounded like a motorboat whenever he would go fast. See, like sometimes I'll stay for like big church. Like there may be once or twice in a month that I do that. And like I sit on the like Sunday school that you do. Yeah, basically I do Sunday school and you basically got the I have never been to Sunday no. school. No. And like that it, it's like I'll be sitting there and like I'll pass some like this. And like when he does it, I'm sitting there and he does and when he's doing whatever he's saying, he'll kinda look at me and I'm just like, please don't tell me to get up and come up there. Please don't say this. Please don't because he'll he'll do this shit too. And you have to stand up just right in the middle just, just like, Don't look at me, please don't. I have had baptism and first communion and that stuff. I've always been baptism. Excuse me, baptized, I'm sorry. I wasn't baptized when I was like two uh, weeks old either. I got baptized a couple of years ago. Three years ago, actually. You said what? You what? Whoa! What the hell is that? I heard that before. What is that? You don't believe in anything. Huh? You don't believe in anything. <laughs> you don't believe in God, and that's what my dad is. My dad used to be doctor, okay? Like 10 years ago. But now he's an engineer at Nissan, and he's a mechanic in his spare time. Obviously, you can tell with the 20 some odd cars in the yard. Yeah, I wish my He still has, like. 
Um, how many he still has they like. Work? Um, do they all work? No, about half of them do. It's just that um, my dad can't really find the time to uh, fix them all. I mean, well, my dad's really bogged down with work. All right, guys. So I'll see you next time.